carrying her. As ready anticipated, to go. Logan. And there's Shax coming up there off the stage. The number one footsie player. You saw those amazing footsies. Yeah, we just, uh, the, the blast in the past of last year. <laughs> in the break. Sakanoko, unfortunately, I think he went out in the exact same stage last year from the looks of it. I'll have to go check the bracket from 2018. Anyway, here we go. This replacing top four. Fenon versus Machabo. The innovator, the original Nikali versus the number one Nikali right well, now. Hi, <laughs> oh, yeah, true. Fenon was very much a bison back then. All right. Already in the corner. Good start here from Machabo. One thing I do love about Machabo's approach to. Oh, nice. Nice whiff punish there, I crouch medium. Approach to winning matchup is the fact that he he doesn't really, I don't think matchups really affect him in terms of psychological. He knows his character can win off a couple of sequences in any set. Mm. And he plays the matches like that. When you see him up against Ibuki oh, no. and others. Jumps over the roundhouse, no activation for you, but he activates his own V-Trigger and his corner time. Backs off, like ground padding. He's going to stay outside the roundhouse range exactly. if possible. No sweep activation no either, for you. and he takes the corner. There's the activation. Ooh, tried to pay out of Stanford, it didn't come. Oh, no! no. Back of Burn. That's dead. No, no, it's not. The critical, I think it just came, or maybe it wasn't there yet. Ooh, got it. Oh, gets hit, though. EX. Danger signs. Oh, oh wow. wake up, EX. Come <laughs> on, <Brad. laughs> Oh, my days. The galactic brain read. What, you thought he was going to do wake up EXDP? No. Scumbag. No. <laughs> oh, much of both, please. We've I seen love, people attempt that, but I they usually get out of it. seeing people get a taste of that old medicine as well. Because <laughs> Phenom would have DP'd there. So. <laughs> oh, man, that was brilliant. But it doesn't matter. Phenom on face. Yeah, angry now. Oh, no. Walks into the low forward. Dash, the walk up knee. Ooh. Honestly, I, I, the more I watch Machabo, the more I feel like that crouch medium is one of the most underrated crouch mediums in the game. It's guys, because you can throw it out, there's literally no risk. Oh, oh try to make a stand throw, jump out. back, he loses the, the round for it. That's unfortunate, he was looking for a throw bait with that stomp. Didn't I think, come. I think having a decent range normal that you can cancel into a safe special is an incredibly good tool in this right? game. I mean, if you have a good range normally you cancel into a plus special, it's even better, but... A low especially. Yes. It Great. really it really stops you from just walking out of, of Nikali's string. Great choice of defense there from Finnell with the delayed jump back. Got him that round. And but now he, he is has susceptible to, to back dashes though, of course. So. He is, yeah. That air reset <laughs> causes him a, lot, a number yeah. of problems. But then you saw Matchabot utilizing that crap fierce against Sako, who was getting a crush counter for the back dash. So. Oh, throw loop time. He's got options for a lot of things. Oh. There's the reversal. Oh, oh. that was it. That would have been the round. Yeah, I think he wanted to he try and make him up. land into the roundhouse to get an activation, but. Looking for that super now. But Finn will look to activate. Oh, buttons! Wow, brave! Wow, that there you was have it. Very brave. Challenging. Thought he was going to steal some frames. He was right. Yeah, his, his read game has been awesome so far in this set. Mm. One step ahead for, for the guesses. Interrupted there, and of course that counter hit. The, the worst thing about getting interrupted is the fact that the counter hit allows the medium to link. I mean, it sucks when you guess wrong that bad. Very common theme in Street Fighter 5, though. We're always doing it now. One nil Machaba. All right. Oh, conversion off that standing medium punch. Oh, with roundhouse as well. On point with the anti air. Yeah, very important in this matchup. Wow. Yeah, I'm really impressed by how quickly um, Phenom has been able to confidently anti air with Karen because it definitely takes a little bit of finesse. Yeah, he's done really well to pick that up. And I think he's one of the best Karens in that regard. Especially for someone who was so lazy with cracks. He was oh standing like Punch in Nikali as well for so long. We used to bury him for that. Oh, we had the counter hit. We didn't commit. Just as we spoke about the, ju the jump ins, he doesn't anti air that one, but V reversals back to safety. 
This jab interrupt, counter hit. This round slipping away from Phenom, he's not careful. Trying to activate. Oh, oh nice, he's the jumped jump the ground pound the again. the ground pound. So good at anticipating that Phenom. Shambhala. It's definitely like the experience of playing the character that's allowed him to land a few of those. Yeah, he's got a good feel for the ins. rhythm. The timings and the spacings at which you're going to want to throw those ground pounds out. Nice anti-air again. Oh, Yo! Great interruption. Oh! Ow. Why did he even do a hard kick there? Oh, big bait! This is going to hurt! Should be the stun, round. Surely it is, and it's yeah, the round. It's done. Uh, 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 uh. Didn't even need the slash. Wow. What a round there from Machabo. Trying to go 2 0 up here. Walks underneath, but doesn't get the trip guard. A little bit too early with that crouch and medium punch. Oh. Showing that he's got crouch and yeah, medium crouch kicks of his kick, own. Man. It's, it's, it's catching Phenom off in terms of where he's standing. Yeah, the range, the range is ever so slightly better than carrying, so it's a good tool in that sense. But I love that little walk up throw there. Goes in. Definitely susceptible to buffered standing medium punches, though. Oh, the roundhouse. <laughs> oh, nice little overhead there in neutral from Fennel. Take that little bit of damage. Again, the low forward comes out. And Matchbow is so good at just controlling that space. Exactly, yeah. He's really standing in the perfect position. I, I feel like he just seems that bit more experienced than the matchup. Oh, there we go. But still, it doesn't matter. Fennel knows he just needs a couple of opportunities, and that's one of them. Backs off and activates. Does Matchbow. Life lead for Fennel. Is Fennel going to be activating soon? Light kicks on the he screen. Really wants that's to activate nice. on here. He doesn't. He gets it. Oh, gets it with a try Doesn't button. matter. Oh. Still in there. Jumps back. Crouch fierce trying to get something going. Oh. The trade and Phenom. Great play from Phenom. Levels it out. One apiece. Yeah, that's with a nod of the head. Super important round out from Phenom. So not be 2 0 down here. Great adjustment. And that's always a problem against Karen. You can feel like you're controlling the neutral with your buttons and your spacing, but. That buffered standing medium punch, man. You leave anything hanging out and it doesn't connect, boy. Matters very little, right? Get clipped with that EX Tenko. Oh, what a jump. Life flashes in front of your eyes very quickly. Wake up buttons, count and hit conversion. And he chooses to cash out on the damage and the stun. Back throw. Very delayed back throw there from Phenom. Good the walk there up is checked again. Uses the V-Trigger immediately. Doesn't confirm it to tank off that crouch medium. Damage left on the table. Yeah, he's ready with the anti-air. Anti -air. Looking for a grab pound overhead. Great round there from Machabo. Good defense. When Phenom had some momentum, the jab interruption. Oh, the stand roundhouse. What did he catch? Was that a V-Skill? I'm not sure. That's in it this time, despite the buttons earlier. He goes straight for the command grab. Oh, the delay! Stands him up! He's in big One danger here. Oh, he went for the fuzzy! Oh, oh, the dark kick at last! <laughs> Hasn't been using that. Been waiting for and him to start using that. Perfect. I've been really surprised it's, he hasn't used it. I mean, yeah, maybe been trying to condition him. We definitely mentioned that the, the anti air element of Karen is difficult because it's quite time and specific, right? It's anti air with the stand fierce. is only like. It's one frame, right? That's really a legit anti air. The yeah. crouch, crouch fierce moves forward, so it's kind of difficult. He's got a standing light punch as well, which is definitely not going to be of any use against Nakali because he's got jump fierce. But there's a lot of uh, very specific timings for anti airs. That EX reversal, though, there needs to and get used. The it's EX reversal, and one thing that. EX Rosenha, let me use the proper, yeah, the proper EX name. Yeah. And one thing that I think um, Punk does better than any Karen is the air to air medium. Yeah. Really good. She gets two hits off it, she gets a little bit of momentum off it, too. Uh, a lot of people do air to airs and they don't get nothing off it. She gets a tiny bit of momentum, which yeah, is from massive. From far jumping, she's got EX Tenko as well, but we're not really talking about that kind of range. Yeah. Okay, we're going to get a mirror. Oh! Okay! Oh, really? Oh, really? Interestingly, we were talking to the players here who were sitting behind us, and they were saying they think Finom should go with Nikali for this. Now, unlike Infectious, Finom's Nikali is very practiced. In fact, I think he won two of his matches on the way here uh, yesterday. Yeah, with Nikali. He used Nikali at game over as well. And he used him at game over too. He has a very, very strong Nikali. The last time these two played in this match in tournament, Venom took it. Been a while since then. Machibo with a little smile on his face. Here we go, Pretty guys. interesting to see that Machibo uses V-Trigger 1 as well, by the way. So he doesn't use the bad breath at all. Mm. 
that too. And I've not actually, aside from against um, Sakho, I've never at any point seen him use the jump move. But sometimes Phenol does use the bad breath. Yeah, I mean, there's setups where it just covers both wake-ups. It's just might it's as well. Active, yeah. Interesting little change, anyway. Of course, Phenom, the one in the Halloween costume, the signature Halloween costume. Those dreads are going to turn bright white. Oh, beautiful time on that, bro. Great first round here from Phenom so far. Oh! oh! And the appropriate punish, too, into Oki. Nice little walk away. Get over here for a loop time. What's it going to be? Oh, what? Well, Point that was... blank. He really, that was a hard read. He was missing the back dash or something. We're not giving up on this round. Phenom's got a quick, oh, beautiful nice, cross cut. Delay back throw. Phenom's got to read this right. Oh, oh bad he bet. doesn't. Wow, Machabo. All the right reads, and he puts himself in set point position here against Phenom. This is loser's bracket. One of these guys is going home. Machabo going in now. It's also a good start there with that misguidance. Phenom definitely doesn't want to go 0 and 2 in top eight. Most of this. Great anti here. Beautiful count hit with that stand medium. Puts the pressure on now, Finnum. Similar to the last round though, started like this. Yep. Can he close it out this time? Tries to jump in. The light DP for the extra meat. Yeah, the jump ins in. have not been working out for him as uh, Nakali and Mashable is willing to show that he's ready and oh again. My days. The cross cut. And he's so using solid. the light more often than not to get the Oki afterwards. Yeah, he is. It's such a, such a good tool. Gets right in his face. Off that anti air. Activation time here. Both of them all leveled up. Walks into that ground pound. Dashes in. Got to be careful there, Finn. The end is near. Can't get hit by that. Oh! There you have it. He's done. Machapo takes Venom out of the tournament. That was so smart. The medium, the medium, the medium, the walk back, the fierce. Beautiful play from Machapo. Exacts revenge from the last time they played. Gets that win in the mirror match and stays alive in this tournament. Unfortunately, that is the end of Venom here at Versus Fight in 2019. But what a run he's had. And honestly, his form the last few weeks has just been nothing short of amazing.